Ladies and gentlemen, Griffin Drago here, and welcome back to uh, my new series of Conan Exile. I promised you a let's play, and that's what I'm going to do. My other series did very well, uh, thanks to you guys, so I'm hoping this does the same, which is why I decided to do a let's play, so let's get into it. Gonna make it very simple, very quick. Uh, who wants that or Kram? Maybe it's a Keto. Okay, gonna go with the Keto. Boys, we'll keep that the same. Head options, I'm not too awful worried about it. Let's see. Uh, I just want to change the hair. There we go. The uh, facial hair, that should be fine. Yep, because I'm an old man. We'll go with that. Eh, yeah, don't need to be very tall. Nerdy none. Physique. Eh, yeah, pump him up a little bit. My last character. I'm to death in the exiled lands. Let's see. Mutiny. Broken brawling. Poor use of punctuation. There we go. <laughs> During the year of the Cobra, a prisoner captured by unknown means was transported into the exiled lands, crucified and left to die for crimes that they may or may not have committed. Death comes swiftly on black wings, until fate intervenes. Thirsty, dead man. Shall I cut you down from that corpse tree? It might kill you. You civilized men are soft. Your lives are not nailed to your spines. I come from, we kill our enemies in battle. We don't leave them in the desert to die like dogs. So, you live again, dead man. This land does not love men. You are marked. Cross the ghost fence wearing that. <laughs> it might have been kinder to leave you on the cross. Live, love, burn with life, slay and survive. We will meet again, dead man.
Okay, that was cool. All right. Now, here we are. There's our dude. Go read this. Behold, bonded one, the very boundaries of civilization. Beyond the passage of our highways, lie the wild places of the world, where untamed savages make endless war upon each other. You cannot pass into the endless wastes enslaved. Your bonding prevents it. Return. Follow the road. Any road. All roads lead to the city. Okay. <clears throat> All right. And here we have water skin. I am Pete. And another note. Left to rot among the ruins of the past. There are others here, slaves, bandits, and cannibals, exiles from lands I've never heard of. Some of them try to scrape a life from the wasteland, scrabbling in the rocks and sand for their own place. I cannot go on. The life that I left behind haunts me. The sun over the glittering spires of Belverus huh? is forever denied me. The smell of my daughter's hair. I will pass the ghost fence, and this cursed land will finally end me. To whoever reads this note, I leave the last of my water and this message. Stranger, you have my pity. You do not know how cursed you truly are. Okay. So, let's see what we need to do here. We should get some clothing. Mm -hmm. I don't have enough to do it. Whoops, didn't mean to jump. So, we'll complete these uh, journey steps as we go along. <clears throat> Probably not in any particular order. I mean, we do need to drink, but I'm not thirsty just yet. So, gathering up some stone. Gotta have more fiber, though. Got a bat demon. Gods cursed this sandstorm. We were forced to take refuge before the wind scoured the skin from our faces. There is something in the storm. Beasts. We hear the skittering of their paws outside the ruins, and their howls mingled with the screaming winds. The men are scared. I've put them to work crafting rudimentary weapons and torches from the loose stones and rough plants that dot this place. I've yet to meet a beast that liked fire, or the bite of the axe. Okay, we should have enough now to make some clothing. Right? Uh. Looks like we're starting to get a little thirsty. Uh, let's see. Let's use it. There. We were kind of thirsty. Uh, we still don't have any food, do we? Wait, is it on our bar? Let's see something. There we go. Now. There. <coughs> Get dressed.
we have to use a better bedroll too. Oh, we're still crafting all that stuff. Okay, um... Oh, there's a little oasis there. Let's see, where is... I'm gonna head up this way, I think. Oops, I keep hitting the wrong button. <laughs> I was just uh, I was just playing Elden Ring and that's how you run. And so, in this game, that button is roll. Oh, this is a nice little place right here. I'm gonna need this. And I'm gonna wanna unlock that, and I'm gonna un wanna unlock that. Because that's the route I'm gonna go this time. Uh, I hate to do it. We might have to unlock a shield too. Uh, um what else? That should be it for right now, I'm thinking. So. We're gonna need that. We're gonna need that. Gonna want this. I need more twine. We're going to need more plant fiber. See if we can't get a better look up here. Okay. Those statues is kind of where I want to go. Just way to get sticks is uh, gonna be the cap a tree. I need sticks for that too, dude. <clears throat> All right. I don't see any sticks. I mean, we can always go around them, but I kind of wanted to actually fight them. You know, get a journey step out of the way. Hi, buddy. I don't want that. Oh, I do want this, though. Make some healing medicine right away. 
go check this patch over here. There really no sticks? That sucks. Oh look, a stick. I think there's a camp over there. Ah, I didn't want to get that close. Crap, 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 run. Come on, leash. Following me anymore. Oh, jerk. Gained level. Bone claws. I wonder if those are any good. I have never used them. Make some more of that. I mean, look at all this stuff we can make. Eh, we're going to make that. Yes, we are. Ah, oh, crap, you're blue. Not good. Oh, there's another one. Oh, man. Screw that. Yeah, you're dead. Ah, oh, you're dead. I was hoping to get some help. Not today. Ha uh ha. -huh. <laughs> uh, Alright. Yeah, there's no way I was fighting him. Ain't no way. Okay, we've discovered the sentinels. This guy. Another new one, eh? I can smell it on you. Veterans tend to smell just a little more like despair. I'm Arcos. Once a sailor, now a wanderer. You didn't think you were the only okay. one, did you? <laughs> you should go up north. There's whole cities of exiles up there. Okay, we learned in the morning there were only them. a few of us. But now it seems like fresh faced fools are showing up every week. Not all of them are as friendly as I am, mind you. Watch your step. There are a lot of desperate people out there. 
bracelets. You can't remove them. Saw one fool cut his arm clean off trying to get rid of it. He bled to death right there in the sand. Nasty business. Leave it on. You'll start to hear the voices soon enough, and then you'll start seeing the ghosts. I don't think the voices are for us. Not for us here and now. I think they were talking to somebody else. Back then. Wherever it was. Whenever it was. Those pillars keep us confined here. Some call it the curse wall, or the ghost fence, or just the boundary. Doesn't really matter what it's called, does it? I walked all the way around it once. Had to be careful not to cross it, of course. Once in the north, I saw a few people on the other side, wearing bracelets just like ours, with gems of amber. It makes you wonder. Huh. Yeah. I'm no scholar, but I've met a few who passed through. They all have mad theories about what the ruins scattered around here are. Lemurians, giant kings, Kari, Velusian serpent men. Do those names mean anything to you? Never mind. It's my experience that men who have their minds in the past get eaten by crocodiles in the present. From the beginning, there were only a few of us. But now, it seems like fresh-faced fools are showing up every week. Not all of them are as friendly as I am, mind you. Watch your step. There are a lot of desperate people out there. Yeah. Bracelets. You can't remove them. Okay. Those pillars keep us confined here. Yeah, that's all he's got to say. Curse wall or the ghost fence or just the boundary. I'm thinking about making a thing on one of those islands over there. First thing I want to do, though. Uh, I need six more of that. Uh, let's go get it. Okay, that should be enough. Make one and then place it down just in case we die. Wait, do I already have one? Oh, I do. Okay, there's a bedroll. I must drink soon. All right. Let's actually place this right here. them both over here. Come on, one at a time. <clears throat> or not. Because our bedroll was right there. So, yeah. <laughs> That's why I did that. Man. Okay. Where is... Where's our 
body. It should be down here, right? bone and I need I really can't wait a minute what if I'm gonna want the stone hatch anyway I bet you I could bone off my body some more more of this plant fiber I could craft one arrow that's freaking awesome dude Well, that's probably all I need is one. Oh no, it gives me ten. Okay. No ammo. Wait a minute, I just equipped it. Use. Oh, there we go. How come my knife's got unequipped? Ah, oh, they're gone. Damn it. Right, I think I'm gonna need better armor to, to deal with that anyway. So...
Hey, there's our island. Sorry, Mr. Bunny, I just wanted to get the, you know, thing done. <laughs> uh. Okay. We don't want that. We don't want that in our... Oh, I thought I made one of them, but I guess not. Not be moved. Okay, well. I don't want that. Okay, let's uh, place that down. Well, I made one of those. Oh, okay, so we need a lot of materials. All right, so I'm going to have to gather some materials, ladies and gentlemen. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to end it here. Um, so, we didn't accomplish a whole lot, but it's a, definitely a new beginning, a new start. So, we're going to find shelter, and we're going to have a meal. We're going to do all that stuff. We'll do all that stuff in the next episode. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for tuning in. Do hope you enjoyed this series i really do like i said the last one went over really well so if you do enjoy please like and subscribe go ahead and hit the bell that way you know when i do the next one you guys are awesome i will catch you in the next episode have a good one